What's good, everybody? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Junk. Now, guys, Patrice Colors is one of the co-founders of Black Lives Matter, and we all know what um, she's been accused of allegedly using the fund for the organization to buy luxury properties and you know the thing that you know black lives matter the original goal which was um protest and police brutality and if that's what the goal of that is for then fine okay then we want to protest police brutality um, brutality against unarmed victims against black men then i personally believe if that is the case then funds for this organization should be used to that situation or for that goal apparently it is not people is over here buying mansions of six million dollars and all that type of shit okay so when it has been exposed that she is out here stealing money buying luxury houses that her lazy ass did not work for because she was dusty and broke before that you have no entrepreneurship uh, in your background, you've never worked for anything to amass that sort of wealth, you get exposed for stealing. Now, Candace Owens decided to come to her residence to kind of put her on blast, right? Which is uh, sort of funny for me. I want to go ahead and play a clip of what Patrice Culler said about the interaction. The right wing media and right-wing pundits are creating an incredibly, and have created an incredibly dangerous environment for me. Um, this morning, I woke up to Candace Owens being outside of my house with a news crew. Um, she was demanding that I come outside um, and uh, when I looked at the video recording of what she was asking about, she was actually asking about the Black Lives Matter Global Network Foundation property. Uh, and for some reason, it seems like she thought my house was that. Um, it's unacceptable and it's dangerous that anybody, any stranger come outside of my house, but it's really unacceptable and dangerous when Candace Owens, another black woman who is actually working as a part of a right wing agenda comes outside of my house with cameras. All right. So you heard what she had to say. Now, Patrice colors, uh, used also the mansion to host parties one for her son's birthday party, which that in itself, shows a level of corruption because why is it that you're using okay your foundation's money who is the people's foundation not yours to have a birthday party for your son now candace owens pulls up and wants to embarrass you this is not a right wing or left wing conversation okay what it is is that you are a fucking thief allegedly that's the conversation that we're talking about all right wrongdoing you're always making this about race racism the white man this and the white man is that now let me just get you let me just you know kind of set you guys straight it is true to a certain degree that racism is going on in in um in, in america and you know you hear like the the, the right wing media is the problem that's bullshit right wing or left wing both wings have problems but in this case neither one is the issue because you are doing wrongdoing you're doing wrong okay you are using the foundation's funds whether you like it or not to host your son birthdays party to have inauguration parties for kamala harris things that have nothing to do with black lives matter it is called corruption so when she comes to your house 
or the house that you don't have because you never worked for any goddamn thing in your life. Is it, would I do it? No. But because she came to expose it, because you don't want to work, why did you steal? That's the situation. That's the question. You've already lied already about two of those uh, things. What else have you lied about? And then you are the people that people trust to do things in the black community. And which is very interesting because you aren't, you and Candace are both an interracial relationship. So if you want to talk about, you know, being power for the people, neither one of y'all are that. So we just going to you know, leave that alone. All right. But why are you using the funds from the organization for your own personal use? That is wrongdoing at the very minimum. You're getting exposed for being a fraud. And what it shows is you don't care about black issues. You want to benefit from black issues. What are you doing to stop black men from being killed in the streets? Black women from being killed in the streets outside of protesting and all that. You don't care about that because you want to live an easy life. You and your wife off of the backs of the death of black men. That's what you want. And then you think that by blowing up the smoke horns, you know, talking about, you know, it's the racism, it's the system of white supremacy. When you over there living nothing but around, nothing but white folks. That's who you live by. That's who you want to be over there with. If you want to be real, you would have never bought that house with your own normal salary. You're supposed to be a nonprofit and you're profiting off of a nonprofit in a corrupt way, allegedly. Then you tell me, ma'am, who's that fault here? Don't blame the right wing media for nothing. Blame yourself for lying. Okay. Blame yourself for lying. Blame yourself for being greedy. Okay. Blame yourself from that. Okay. That's the issue. All right. That is the issue. And, P and if it's not what you deserve, why are you being corrupt? Okay. Again, I wouldn't come out there and do that. But again, Candace is in the right wing media. They're trying to expose you. And I tell black people all the time, neither group is going to save us. These people both are puppets. Candace and Patrice. It is up to you to save your community. It is up to you to build your community. It is up to you to build your family because these people don't care about you. Neither one of them. Candace Owens, damn sure don't care about the black community, in my opinion. And neither does the other lady. So if you look to them to lead you, you're always going to get stuff while they're getting richer and richer every day. Work with your people to solve your problems. Black Lives Matter wants to victimize you. Candace Owens wants to tell you that racism never existed. <laughs> Listen, lead yourself. Stop letting these clowns do it. But guys, what do you think? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Jungle. I appreciate your follow you do. Subscribe at the bell. Check out the first company at the top. And as you know, the buffoon remains at all-time high. I'm out.